You know, I'd like to discuss Lyme disease and the lymphatic system. Lyme disease can affect many different parts of the body. I've seen many patients and it ranges from arthritis to heart problems to neurological problems to not sleeping, digestive problems. Uh, it really can run the gamut. So I believe in Lyme. It's something that could be tested. But what I believe we're missing is how Lyme bacteria and the subsequent treatments are creating excess cellular waste that's clogging our lymphatic system. And maintaining the lymphatic system in Lyme treatment may be one of the most overlooked treatments out there. If you can imagine you're going through this uh, treatment for detoxification, whatever you may be doing, whether it's antibiotics or whether you're seeing a naturopathic physician and going through a whole round of uh, many different things uh, to open the body, to clear the body, to kill bacteria, we really have to include activating the lymphatic system. Lymph drainage therapy, manual lymph drainage, lymph practic, what I do here, but it really is about activating the body's sewage treatment plant. I believe when you have Lyme, it's the straw that breaks the camel's back. You may have already had a little bit of a lymphatic problem. Many of the people I talk to who have neurolog neurological problems with Lyme and not sleeping and depression, I talk to their parents or to them and I ask if they've had this when they were younger and some you know, did. One mother said her son never slept as a child. So even though I believe in Lyme and that we can have this bacteria from ticks, I believe we're missing how waste in the body, and especially acidity, because this waste makes acidity in the body, uh, is constricting our lymphatic system, uh, manifesting many of the uh, problems associated with Lyme disease, like arthritis, uh, neurological Lyme, where they have pain in their head or can't think clearly. Uh, so again, I've seen many clients with Lyme. Uh, mostly they come to me from naturopathic doctors, so they're already uh, on some type of protocol. But what I emphasize is the lymphatic system's role in cleaning this cell material from the body and alkalinizing the body to open up the lymphatic system to make it better. And one of the biggest things I think that we should be doing for Lyme is systemic enzymes. Systemic enzymes are proteolytic enzymes you take on an empty stomach that break down cellular waste. And a big, they're a big part of detoxification because often in Lyme treatment, I see people get stuck, their body gets overwhelmed. Remember, we have one little vessel on either side of our neck that takes the thousands of lymph vessels. So it can really get clogged up easily and lymph drainage therapy, making sure you're more alkaline, deep breathing, posture. Sometimes I see a lot of these Lyme patients, they come in and they're sitting all slouched because they're feeling so sick and horrible. And once I explain to them that they have to sit up a little straighter, you know, it makes sense to them. And, and try it. I mean, if you sit like this for a while, you feel uncomfortable. If you sit straight, it's almost like you're opening something up and you're allowing flow to happen. So if you have Lyme disease and if you're having a problem and not getting well, contact me. I'll explain how my work, even my coaching can help you. Uh, just imagine we're really not including the lymphatic system in the idea of Lyme. And again, it's what's cleaning bacteria, it's what's cleaning cell material. So we have to give this uh, system a little bit of help. If I can help you with your problems associated with Lyme, contact me at johnosipinski.com.